no one shows up. No one cares. They can see it every day all around them. But the moment someone shows up of significance, the moment uh, one of their heroes comes to town, you have the opportunity to change. You have to take responsibility for what you do. You can't say, I didn't get up and go to school because I didn't have no clean clothes. Well, then why didn't you wash them out the night before? Never make excuses. My teammates gave me this nickname, the Junkyard Dog, because they said I was chained to the bench. I was ferocious. When the coach took the chain off, it was like unchaining a dog. I started programs while I was playing in the NBA. We wanted to reach out to the community and do meaningful programs for kids. Reading programs, after school programs, financial literacy programs. Now I have digital learning for kids and they're in 20,000 schools across the U.S. The world around us is changing and if you don't change the programming, <laughs> you know, you won't even reach a lot of these millennials. As an NBA player, you know, people used to pay to see me play. I said to myself, once I retire, I have to still use that same thing. Now I can't jump as high and I can't do the same things that I could do, but I had to bring the kids in, get them excited, and what better way is something that is my playground. We're shooting for peace. It's all about love, unity. It's all about giving back, and it's all about having fun. They might be just motivated by the basketball game. That might be the one thing that lures them in. So adding education components to those things are what benefits not only the kid, but the neighborhood, the community, and everything else. When kids take the time to do something extra in school, such as writing poetry, we think they're all winners. You know, there's all these other things that I can do now as a global ambassador that I could not have done without a degree. So those things are what I am able to relate to them and have them strive to reach their full potential. We hustle, we fight. That's the champ in me. But crossing over to the high life seems like a long travel and a double dribble to me. Behind my back, you lay up for millions to see. Telling me to play my position only limits me to the things I practice when you preach. But you don't care. I try to read your soul, but you don't stare. And that's a foul. I could tell you haven't smiled in a while. The one resource that a lot of people have that they don't understand that they have is hope. When we can deliver hope to communities, to kids, you take them further away from hopeless. Because hopeless is where the problems start. You say, what did we do? To thy own self be true. So if you look in the mirror and you're honest with yourself, you will always achieve because you will always know what to do and the right thing to do. Keep that in mind, you be straight. I would listen to what he was saying, but then once he came and got me, it showed me that like not everybody out there hurt you. you know? Some people really do care about what you're going through. And like he just like he came and got me. That let me know that he was answering shit and what I had to say. Sometimes it's not what you say, it's what you do. I don't necessarily have to say something to a kid to get their attention. It's your error, your presence, your emotion, your eye-to-eye -eye contact. You know, just looking in a kid's eyes and you showing that you're present with them for two seconds could speak volumes more than a 10 minute conversation about nothing. Seeing others do it and knowing that anything is possible for me, I, I took it and like, you know what, let me put my feet in, let me move already to doing something because me doing something like this opening doors even more. Talent was a cleanup board, so I grabbed them all. Now they call me Junkyard Dog, help build the community. 
left in hand from state to state and team to team. I had a passion to reach the teams, give them direction, help move close to their dreams. So I stand tall. YDT on, never on the block, got my MSG on Not because of someone else, but because I stepped away from the crowd just to be myself Dog Pound is the fans, and they're all around me Everywhere I walk is an opportunity And it's a mental thing, it's a connection Because I understand something about you, and you understand something about me You know what I want I need you to bark you guys are excited. This is shooting for peace. We're glad to be in Joseph S. Clark High School, and we're gonna keep coming back. And that's what time it is for 